Right, hip circles, gonna get those hips moving, lift the knee up, and you're just gonna make nice big circles, staying as still and central as you can, bigger circles as you can. So this is a forward lunge with lat stretch, so you're gonna really get that lunge forward, stretch those hip flexors, lift the arms up, and really feel the stretch in the lats. Have a little rest go into another one. Right, this one's 90-90 hips. You're gonna get your legs, your knees in 90 degrees and just hold it, staying as central as you can and as straight on as you can. You'll really feel it down this side. Nice, simple kneeling trunk rotation. You're just gonna really rotate that upper body. Bottom half can't move because you're kneeling down. If you wanna add a bit of resistance to it, get a resistance band, but literally just holding the end position, both sides. Right, nice upper body rotation, this one. Knee on a foam roller or something, it's just to keep it there, nice and solid. Upper body facing the way your knee is, and you're just gonna open up, open that thoracic, get some mobility in that upper body, in the trunk. Don't forget to do both sides. 12 to 15 reps each side. Right, so this is a single leg cone touch. You can use anything, but I find cones quite easy. You're gonna get set on one leg and with the same sided hand as the leg, you're gonna go down and you're gonna touch all three cones, having a break in between, trying to stay as stable as you can and then switch to the other leg. This is a lunge med ball chop. You're gonna lift your back leg off the floor in the lunge position, get yourself set. And then I've got a two kilogram med ball here. You're literally just gonna chop low to high across your body. Banded press up, get it across your back, get into the press up position. And literally it's just a simple press up, but with resistance makes it that little bit harder. Nice, simple one, frog jumps. You're literally gonna squat down and explode and jump as far as you can. So that, and then hold the position at the end. So this one is just a side lunge, working that glute, hold it for as long as you can, then explode out of it, back to the start. 10 reps I recommend on this one, really activates that glute. 